Today's lesson, we learned how to solve word problems using addition and subtraction. We need to find the keywords in each word problem to know which maths operation to use. Altogether, difference between, how many, keyword, left, operation, solve. What did we do today? We learned how to solve word problems by finding key words. Today, we learned about word problems. Let's take a look at one of the word problems. I plan on bringing 12 students with me. Seven more students want to join the trip. How many students are there all together? Find the first number in the problem. I plan on bringing 12 students with me. Seven more students want to join the trip. How many students are there all together? Find the next number in the problem. I plan on bringing 12 students with me. Seven more students want to join the trip. How many students are there all together? Then we find the keyword that tells us if we add or subtract. I plan on bringing 12 students with me. Seven more students want to join the trip. How many students are there all together? Let's look at the other word problems we did. Mun's book have 153 pages. He has read 37 pages. How many pages does he have left? Find the first number in the problem. Mun's book have 153 pages. He has read 37 pages. How many pages does he have left? Find the next number in the problem. Mun's book have 153 pages. He has read 37 pages. How many pages does he have left? Then we find the keyword that tells us if we add or subtract. 
Mun's book had 153 pages. He has read 37 pages. How many pages does he have left? Let's look at the examples with different keywords. Vun is 95 centimeters tall and May is 80 centimeters tall. What is the difference between their heights? Vun is 95 centimeters tall and May is 80 centimeters tall. What is the difference between their heights? Vun is 95 centimeters tall and May is 80 centimeters tall. What is the difference between their heights? Vun is 95 centimeters tall and May is 80 centimeters tall. What is the difference between their heights? Here are the worksheet answers from today. One means when shopping and hot nine cupcakes eight apple peas and seven donuts how many things did we buy all together answer 24 two type plays with a grab on monday he played for 67 minutes on tuesday he played for 32 minutes. On Wednesday, he played for 43 minutes. How many minutes did Thai play for together? Answer, 142. My pet, 46 cookies for her friends. Her friends ate 32 cookies and she took the rest home. How many did my have left? So, 6, no, 32. Answer, 14. For the teacher gave with 120 stickers, she put 30 on her helmet, 20 on her pencil case, and gave her friends 20 stickers. How many stickers has Quinn got left? So Young walking. 120 minutes, 30 minutes, 20 minutes, 20. Answer 50. Five, Lee jumped 20 centimeters and Gwyn jumped 25 centimeters in centimeters. What is the difference between the lengths they jumped? So you are working 25 minutes, 20. Answer five.
next, there are 24 people on a bus. 17 more get on. How many people are on the bus now all together? So you're working 24 plus 17. Answer 41. All together. All together. When we see this in a word problem, we know to add. Difference between. Difference between. When we see these words in a word problem, we know to subtract. How many? How many? When we see this question in a word problem, it means we need to find the number or amount of something. Keyword. Keyword. This is an important word that helps us find the answer. Left. When we see this word in a word problem, we know to subtract. Left. Operation. Operation. The different maths operations are add, subtract, multiply, divide. Solve. Solve. Solve to find the answer.